After we made sure that the basic uh, striking uh, abilities, basic, okay, are there, and I can do hooks and uppercuts, uh, I now try to work with the sabaki. We have been building on since the beginning of the training here. So this is, I think, week number seven. And this is a continuation of what we did in the training session last Tuesday. So uh, the opponent walks behind me, okay? Immediately, not a uh, proper boxing. He walks behind me. And uh, what I do is, I do diagonal forward, turn, and hook. Okay, and then diagonal forward, turn, and hook. So that demands his attention. He's the coach now, he's training me. Why he has to be on point wherever I do a hook or a strike. So let's try. Move from the attacking path, turn, hook. Move, and with respect to the kata. Now we do it walking. So he walks behind me, and I, the student, initiate. To pay attention to these old mattresses. I am moving out of the path of what I think is an attack, turn around and do a hook. And hopefully it's not a friend. Okay? So let's do it again. And of course, usually I don't walk like this in the street. <laughs> Same thing. Now that we did it, I did the same thing. And and, and we do back and forth. So nice and easy. It's a simple training session. Let's take a deep look again at the sabaki of the legs if you're not tired. So that means if he stands behind me. Diagonal, turn. Here. Diagonal to the other side, turn. Here. Okay? <laughs> That's it. Take it easy, guys.